Impress me each and every weekend, but he's got his work cut out for him. Two guys he's going against are definitely no slouches. Starts off with a good fight. So it is about staying in control. It's half for the bull, half for the bullfighter, just like we would judge a regular, like just like a bull ride. Absolutely, and it's a game of changing directions. You watch Cade there, he leads the bull in one lead. A, a bull's going to travel much like a horse does on a lead, either the left foot or the right foot out in front. You want to keep changing that up. When the bull cuts to the inside of you, you're going to go back the other way. Uh, and then when the bull's running at you, you can throw a jab step, uh, what we call a fake. Kay's trying to set up for a jump right here, get a good sell to a, to a good fight. Here he is, makes it clear what a great job. He is so smooth. It all comes down and Kay Gibson going for two wins in a row. Look to the man from Slaughter, Louisiana, Knox Dunn, third generation. This guy, let me tell you something, it was born and bred in him. And Knox Dunn owning this moment, picking this bull up. 13 seconds remain. And Knox Dunn trying to get control here. Five seconds in the mandatory version. Then he'll have 15 seconds of bonus time if he wants to pick a sell spot. So now we're here. Bulls in his hip pocket. 10 seconds to go. And Knox Dunn. Louisiana pride and joy from down there about highway 412 trying to pick it up. And all the way to the bitter end for Knox Dunn. And there you go for the young talent. Tristan Sargent, Mineral Wells, Texas. And here we go. Right here. There you see the clock. Matt West joining me up here. Yeah, watch that this. left hand. He's reaching back. He's going to grab that bull by the horns. Check that out. That's to show that he's in complete control. Now he's got to get reconnected, get that bull's attention. Nice little fake to the right. Step through, face up. One more. Got a little bit of time left to go. Got to have to finish with something strong here. He's down to five seconds. Nice little pass through the front. One more final step through, and there it is. Folks, how about your bullfighter here tonight? Yeah. I oh, he, he's going to keep – he's got 10 seconds left. 10 bonus seconds left. And I thought he sold it Look there, but hey. He did that. What's up, Texas? Tristan Sargent thought he had kind of stepped away and said that was enough, but finished up strong with the yeah. final remaining seconds. He's fired up. Arlington, what do you say? How about the young man from Mineral Wells? Ooh. And Tango down from Lights Out Cattle Company, supplying the Spanish fighting bulls here for us all weekend long. And these bulls coming out of Uvalde, Texas. And look at that right there. Fantastic. And there he is, awaiting the numbers. Pre-cooked, thin slice, beef marinated, a family recipe, au jus. Papa Charlie's will give you a beef sandwich like you've never had before to get some tonight at your local Hy-Vee. Heat it up, eat it up. 15 minutes, dinner is served. Papa Charlie's bringing families back to the table. Folks, there is a young man from California right now on your big screen, our final AFB bullfighter, the 21-year-old. Very exciting. The Sasquatch, we like to call him. And ready to roll. Watch this guy right here. Look. No problemo, still on his feet. Now, engage. Little fake. And look at him go to work. The Sasquatch. Time. 
bottom is slipping. Now you got 15 seconds left. Squatch, that's what you got. Now give it to him. Oh! oh. Took a monster shot. And he went very right back to him. Woo. I can think of a million ways. Look at that bull just said, I'm done. I can think of a million ways. And the finishing move is yep. a million and one. That is oh. not. Oh. Oh, man. And so now, for Mr. Gonzalez awaiting the numbers to come in to make this official. And the numbers are in. How about 88 points? 88. There's your winner tonight.